Welcome to Decker Tech. I'm Aaron Decker, and today we are lighting things on fire. Uh, Cornelius here. We're going self burn build. Uh, I wanted to kind of showcase what he can do, and I really wanted to do it against an elite or someone that's immune to burn. It's kind of awkward that Celsius is immune to burn, so he's a little weaker than his average counterpart, but I am taking a Corruptor. This is max difficulty. It really doesn't get much harder than this because he's immune to burn. So I say harder than this, but it <laughs> it'll be pretty fun. Um, so I'm not really going to talk about the build much. Um, we'll just click through his items really quick, but if you want to see the actual um, the build video, there is that. You can find that. I'll try to link it. Um, we got the rusty armor. We got the lava crisp. We got the pipe. We got basically everything he needs. So he's, he's set in full build right now. So let's see how it goes. Do the normal Magnus things. All the very pretty Magnus things. I'm not going to explain any of this. Uh, Wolf Guard going on the front because we have a purge block. Yep, that just happened right there. So we're going to have a little burn war. Celsius versus Cornelius. Who shall win? Uh, Storm Chicky. She's Storm applies wet. Wet puts out fire. We need to destroy her, right? So let's take care of that. Like Cornelius on fire a little bit. Actually, I think I'd rather have the... Do, 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 do. Don't mind the Evelyn doing Evelyn things. Uh, put an insulate on Cornelius. That's a big point. We need insulate. We need to light him on fire a bit. We need to give him some cards and some energy. Oh, do we need to enchant him? We don't need to enchant him yet. So we're going to use enchant weapon on ice because Celsius... Um, is such. I'm not going to use it yet, though. I'm going to wait for next round. Didn't get as many cards as Cornelius as I'd like, so hopefully he can actually do his thing. Uh, start with these. So these bookworms, they're just basically scrolls of intellect. They're just here to thin our deck, right? And then all these scrolls are going to go to Otis. Well, actually, maybe the cards should go to Otis and the energy to Evelyn, because she's got the arcane conduit going on. So I wouldn't mind giving her some more energy to play with because it's really nice to have someone else set you on fire. So what are we missing in our deck? Two inner combustions. Hmm, that might be problematic. We might not be able to kill this bird on turn one, which is unfortunate. So we've got seven energy plus three from fire starter. So 10, so three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We can cast everything. So uh, protect ourselves from fire, light ourselves on fire. And we've got both steering novas. So with immolate, since it doubles your fire, your your burn stacks on yourself, you want to do it when you have like two appliers afterwards. Like, so if I only had inner combustions, I would save one or two inner combustions for after the immolate, so I got as much burn on the opponents as possible. But with this hand, I've got two searing novas, so those will come after the immolate. So I'll just do inner combustions first because searing novas don't add any burn to myself, right? So in this case, I want to add as much burn to myself as possible. And then once I've applied as much burn to myself as I can, I'm going to double that burn. And then I'm going to apply my burn to everyone. Unfortunately, we're not killing Bird Chick. If we had one more, like if we had one more of the inner combustions, she'd be dead right now, I'm pretty sure. Because she'd be at 250 stacks, and 250 stacks does, you know, 480 damage. So we're fine. These fiery shields, this is how we're going to get past, like you see Celsius here. He's got, he's taking zero damage, 95% fire resist, and immune to burn. This is the hardest thing for, for Cornelius to kill. So, we're going to save these for later. It would been really nice if those had been combustions, right? Um, I think we want some scrolls to Eve, and then she'll give the rest to Corn on her turn. And doing the normal... You do not want to put buffer on Cornelius, and you do not want to mass dispel or healing rain or anything like that, because you don't want... I don't want these burn stacks gone, right? So... Uh, let's just give Cornelius some hit points just because it doesn't really matter what I'm doing on this. I guess I could have given Magnus some love, but Magnus is fine, right? We're here for Cornelius. Uh, maybe she'll die once I get uh, some vulnerable on her. That'll be nice. She's still at not nine, negative 95%, so if I can get a little more vulnerable stacks on her... No luck there. Yeah, it's still not going to die. But it'll be close. I mean, I, pr I just need one more set of stacks, right? 
And I think Eve has enough. Let's give Cornelius some love. Because Cornelius has to draw, what, three, nine cards? So Cornelius needs two more Inspire. Light Cornelius on fire. Uh, Bird hasn't taken its turn. Cornelius is going before Bird. So I actually just need to blow up this guy right here. Pop. Yep, deleted. And I can delete another thing, because Eve is <laughs> doing fantastic things. Um, so maybe if I kill... I would like to save... I'd like to do this as quick as possible, but I'd also like to save... Um, here, let me just do more and talk less. How about we do that? Since Cornelius is going before Windcaller, right? More fire. More cards. All right, he's at full amount of cards here. So energy, I don't really care who I give it to. Drawing the cards, I'm just going to get sc scrolls and a cauterize, right? So Eve here is kind of... Let's do the frost weapons. Just have more burn, dude. Sorry, Evelyn with her um, arcane conduit really hurts my brain trying to figure out what card card order to play because she just redraws her deck like five times, right? All right, so everyone's dead other than this guy back here. But the key is I still don't want to use these fiery shields until it's just him, until I have much more fire stacks. So to get more fire stacks, I need to emulate myself. The problem is I turned on frost weapons, so I'm not blocking as much emulate as I should have. So I probably should have put flash weapons on later because I'm not blocking the emulate damage, right? Because I only have 87 frost resist instead of 95. But I just want to make sure I don't kill myself when I cast this emulate, but I want to have as much burn on myself before I do so. So he's immune to burn, but we're still just going to... I think we're just going to chunk him a little bit. So I am just keep checking this emulate, make sure I'm not going to kill myself when I cast it. And I'm just putting more and more... Because as I put more fire on myself, it's going to do more damage to myself. Because I want to get to, you know, 200 burn stacks here, right? So, ooh, look at this emulate. Man, look at how much damage it's doing now. Oh, yeah. Pop. All right, everyone's at way max burn. And uh, this will chunk the back guy for 190. And I have four shots. It's not going to guarantee a kill, so I'll just hold off one more turn. But, I mean, Cornelius is in danger, so let's uh, give him some love. I mean, he's got insulate, he's got fireproof, he's got all the resistances, but at 200 burn stacks, I mean, he's taking half the damage still, right? Sorry, I kind of slowed this down. It's really that the Eve slows me down a lot. But as you can see, what we're doing is since he's immune to burn, I'm just, I switch my, my damage type to something he's not immune to, and I'm relying on my cards in my deck that do the based on, yeah, see, he's fine, he's fine. Just gonna eat through 175, 178 block with no issue. It's fine, still fine. I might let him on fire a little more. Combust does nothing against this guy. Let's more fire. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely not a good idea, but you know I'm here for the memes, right? But as you can see, 200 and something fire. He's still alive, right? He's got 45% fire resist still, so we are in a good place. I can kill him with Immolate. I don't want to do 48 damage, 42 damage myself because I changed. So since I changed this to Frost, and I'm now actually higher Frost resist, like it's it's a weird kind of thing you could do to manipulate this. So let's just do this to double my burn stacks. So I'm at 250 because that's cap. And uh, yeah, pop. That's self burn Cornelius. You can do it every time. Um, that was like I said one of the harder fights because someone is immune to burning. Otherwise. Max burn stacks and a little bit of vulnerable application. You can get anyone to to the, uh, what's it called? Um, negative 95% fire resist. Uh, fireproof, fire starter. I don't want either of these. Phoenix can kind of be a safety valve if I needed it. But like I said, you can just go watch the video if you want to see more details on this. And yeah, I'm done kind of showcasing that. I kind of want to do another one. 
You might see another video here shortly because I like Cornelius. Maybe Act 4? Maybe Act 4. Let me know what you think.